we had some goals that we achieved and goals that we didn't achieve. Uh, we came out, we had 14 possessions. Uh, we capitalized on eight of those with touchdowns, uh, but we did have to punt those other four, and then we had one turnover. Well, we were excited about the rush defense in the first half. We really stayed to our fundamentals and our keys, and we were able to stop the run. We've got to continue to do that. Uh, this opponent that we're seeing this next week, though, is a different caliber. This team is big and fast, and so we got to make sure that we're disciplined and we don't get too big-headed. You look at their roster, they've got some new additions, but their D-line is big and quick. Their linebackers are back, they have some length, and then their secondary is a, is a veteran group. So, you know, we have our hands full. I'll tell you what, they're a good football team on offense. they got a good quarterback, they got a lot of speed on the perimeter. They've got some run pass reads that really keep you honest. They're a complete offense, uh, so I'm excited to see the test that we're going to have this Saturday. By no means do I think that uh, you know, we can go into this game expecting the same outcome if we don't work. For us, it is about fundamentals. We're not where we need to be yet. Uh, and our goal is to make sure that we're getting better each week. We've been talking about uh, ever since the beginning of camp is focus and direction. When you come out here, be where you're at. Be in the moment. Take care of your responsibility. It's too much to look at the big picture a lot of times. You've got to take it period by period, evaluate that, see how well you did, see how well you didn't do, and correct that as soon as possible.